This week's Ask Dr. Dury comes from a patient very anxious to get a, a booster for the COVID-19 infection. This particular patient had the J&J &J vaccine as the first vaccination and now wants to know what should they do about the booster. Well, the first thing is, it's just so important for myeloma patients to go ahead and get that booster shot because it can increase the antibody levels much more to, to fight the COVID infection. However, it is a very good question in terms of which uh, vaccine might be the best as a booster. So the first point is that all of the three vaccines have now been approved by the FDA and the CDC as uh, boosters. So the J&J &J has an approved booster, as does Pfizer and Moderna. So that's the first point. But the second uh, very important point is that both the FDA and uh, CDC have approved what they call mix and match. And so depending on which one you got first, you can actually use one of the other vaccines later. And so this does really open up the possibilities for this uh, particular patient because in the mix and match testing, it turns out that there is an important difference in terms of the boost that you get with a, a second J&J &J or a booster, which is actually a third vaccine with either Pfizer or Moderna. And it turns out that with a J&J &J booster, you get a four times increase in your antibody level. If you get a Pfizer booster, you have an increase in antibodies times about 40 or so. If you get a Moderna booster, you actually get an increase in antibodies up to 76 times. And so there really is a much stronger boost with the Moderna, the mRNA uh, vaccine, in patients who receive the J&J. &J. And so for myeloma patients, every antibody level makes a difference to get to that higher level that can fight off infection. And so although it would be okay to take any of the uh, vaccines, I would suggest uh, talk to your doctor, but I would consider uh, getting the uh, Moderna as a first choice, uh, Pfizer as a second choice, and then of course you can definitely get a J&J &J, uh, booster vaccine. And so the main thing is boosters are so important uh, for patients with myeloma, particularly uh, patients who have had active myeloma and are, are taking ongoing treatment. So get that booster and talk to your doctor about the pros and cons of, of maybe getting a Moderna versus just uh, following on with that J&J &J vaccine.